How's it going everybody? Zab here. Welcome to another NHL 15 Hockey Ultimate Team, Team of the Week, review, overview, thoughts, opinions, all that good stuff video. Uh, I know this week has quite frankly sucked for the videos. I've been really busy, yeah, 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 blah, 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 blah. You guys don't want to hear the excuses, I know. Uh, videos will be more frequent in the near future, but for right now, you know what? I make videos when I can, and just unfortunately, things have been really busy, and I haven't been able to crank out the videos like I necessarily would like to, which are those daily videos. So, they're going to be a little scarce for the foreseeable future in the next week or two, I'd say. Uh, but after that, we should get things back rolling. The team of the week uh, is gross. It is straight up and down absolutely disgusting, and there's one card. I know if you've seen the team of the week, and I know if you saw the banner. There is one card that is... I'm just going to call that card Viagra because you know what it's doing to my body. It is an absolutely disgusting card, and we're going to get right into it. Uh, I am going to pick up the card without a doubt at some point. It has to be done. Uh, but anyway, okay, fourth line. Not going to try to pronounce a lot of these people's names. Bennett, Garland, uh, Marcotte, Marcotte. Anyway, some uh, some guys that aren't going to be very desirable. Uh, Oliver Bjorkstrand, uh, Cousins. Cousins, Cousins, Ford, and on to the NHLers. Milan Lucic, a 91 overall left wing power forward, a big guy, uh, 6'4", 235, 96. Gross, ouch, for the checking. 91 for the defense, 89 for the hands, 91 for the shot, uh, and an 88 for the skating. Pretty good looking card. Fourth liner, maybe. Uh, nothing past that for my team personally. Richie, a 77 overall right wing power forward for the Stars. He is 6'3", 220. 82 for the skating, 80 for the shot, 76 for the hands, 85 for the checking, 77 for the defense. And Viagra, here he is, boys, at center. Matt Duchesne, the doucher, the doucherino, uh, 93 for the skating, disgusting. 90 for the shot, vomit-inducing. 91 for the hands, boner-raising. 86 and 87 for the checking and defense, eh, decent. But the best card I've ever used in my life has been the normal, regular base, Matt Duchesne. I still have him on my first line, and this card would be absolutely perfect because it would finish out that Team of the Week first line of Team of the Week Ovechkin, Team of the Week Crosby, and then Team of the Week Duchesne. And we're actually going to check to see if there are any in the market uh, I'll probably include it in the video just because I'm curious, but uh, a disgusting looking card. He's going to be going for a lot, no doubt, but I would definitely, you know, probably trade away my Duchesne and Pucks uh, or Coins for Team of the Week Duchesne. So if anyone out there, anyone's watching this video who has a Team of the Week Duchesne or knows someone who has a Team of the Week Duchesne on Xbox One, let me know immediately because I will pay up the a-hole for Matt Duchesne. Disgusting looking card. Uh, then Zetterberg in 97. Again, another disgusting one. A 97 overall left wing playmaker. Uh, 94, 92, 96, 89, 97. It's disgusting. I don't even need to mention Zetterberg. I have used his normal card in the past. Pretty good. Hartnell, 89 overall, uh, left wing power forward, 87 for the skating, 91 for the shot, 90 for the hands, 91 for the checking, 88 for the defense. Looks like a pretty good card for his price. Uh, I don't know what his price is going to be, but just considering his overall isn't super high and his name isn't necessarily the biggest name in hockey, I'm going to go ahead and expect he's, I don't know, 50K, 40K, somewhere around there. So probably not going to be the most expensive player. Looks like a decent player uh, you know, for that price range. And then Eberle, an 88 overall right wing sniper, 87 for the skating, 89 for the hand, shot, excuse me. 80 or Jesus 90 for the hands 82 for the checking 86 for the defense uh, I have used normal Eberly in the past was not a fan whatsoever so I don't know what uh what this card is going to play like but in my past I haven't had luck with Everly even in NHL 14 he sucked I used I think he had a team of the week back then I used it and it was absolutely horrible so I uh, just have not had luck with Everly so probably not gonna be defensively uh we have Fram and Akdad. Uh, then we have Belmore, 78 overall, right D defensive defense, but not even going to go over the stats. This video is going to go on long enough looking to see if there's and 88 overall left D, two weight D, Zid licking my balls, 86 overall right D offensive defenseman in McNabb, and 82 overall left D, two weight D. The defense looks pretty not that great this week. Uh, offensively, there's definitely a few crazy players. Rask, a 93 overall gold is going to be. Oh, man, Bruck, Bruckman, Bruckman. Uh, there you go, guys. Uh, as far as the top three, uh, I'm going to go ahead and say number one, I'm, I would say Zetterberg because he's the probably going to be the most expensive. 
but I'm going to go off of not price, but who I want on my team, the cards that look the nastiest. And it would probably be Duchesne in number one. Number two would probably be Zetterberg. And uh, number three would be definitely Lucic. I really want to try him. 96 for the checking just sounds absolutely disgusting. So that's my top three. Let me know what your guys' top three are also in the comment section section below. Let me know what your guys' thoughts and opinions are on this team of the week. Uh, what would you give it? A system from A to F or from 1 to 10, what would you give it? I'd probably give it a solid 7 or 8 out of 10 and like i don't know a b b plus it's a really good team of the week other than that defense is not that great but goaltending offensively pretty good i uh, can't complain there and i just want to go ahead and check just because i'm curious here i normally don't do this crap in the video but let's go ahead and take a look see poo at uh at the team of the week here cards i want to see if there are any duchenes on the market because it's seriously the most disgusting card i've ever used as far as his normal cards so uh, we'll go to playmaker and there we go just in case anyone changes position i'm not going to go there we'll go to air not arizona that's for dang sure we're going to go to where is colorado there it is and then country will go to Canada. Any on the market? I'm guessing no. Ooh, one on the market with a start price of, of course, 430k. <laughs> Send nudes. Very classy. Any last sold price? Yeah, this is the only one on the market. He has never been sold for coins, at least to my knowledge. So I don't know what he's going to be going for. He's only a plus one boost, though. So, you know, once once the market kind of settles, I don't think he's going to be going for that much more. Um, I'd probably be willing to do, I don't know, right off the bat, I'd probably be willing to do 80K and the normal Duchesne. I think that would probably get him just because I, a plus one overall boost, probably not going to be worth that much more. But a disgusting looking card. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this Team of the Week update. Uh, if you did, please do hit that big thumbs up button. Subscribe for much, much more, guys. As always, I'm Zab. And a side note here, another thing. I want to know what you guys want to see. I've been dabbling in the Grand Theft Auto world. My past few videos have actually been GTA videos, and uh, they're not necessarily the most uh, well-recepted and most popular on my channel, just because I'm not acclimated as a Grand Theft Auto uh, YouTuber, of course, but I do have fun recording them. So let me know what you guys want to see. More Zab podcast, more GM mode, uh, more player reviews, more uh, goalie reviews. What do you guys want to see? And uh, go ahead and leave that in the comment section down below. So again, like I was saying, we'll go ahead and restart this. If you did enjoy this video, please do hit it with a big thumbs up. Subscribe for much, much more, guys. As always, I'm Zab. And I'll see you next time. Pull my heart out of my chest, train my mind so I forget. Sing